definitely not a plane. Whoa, that is moving so fast. That is thousands of miles an hour. Oh my god. One hell of a UFO. Wow. Hey everyone, this is Michael at The Vast Experience. Today we're going to be looking at a UFO video and we did it interview style and it's based around last Sunday. Uh, like, subscribe and hit the notification bell. Hope you enjoy. Thanks. So today is uh, August uh, 12th, I think. Yeah. Right? Yeah. And we've had some really cool, I shouldn't use the word vast, <laughs> vast experiences. <laughs> Um, over the last month, a lot of sky watches and nature walks and really cool experiences. Sunday was a full day, a wide variety of experiences. And the day started with, uh, I did a, a past life regression on, on a friend of ours. Uh, one of the themes was um, uh, this lady uh, in her past life um, became Eagle. And the interesting thing was on our nature walk, uh, we saw an eagle in the tree and it was fascinating. Mike took a picture of it and um, it was there for a long time. It wouldn't budge. It wouldn't move. There was, and then another one came along, I was about to say, another one came along too. Two eagles and then looking at the clouds in the sky, uh, the eagle, uh, the cloud turned into, a, a, believe it or not, an eagle, yeah, an eagle <laughs> head yeah. and um, we gifted uh, Rose, oh, let's say names, um, with a feather. <laughs> uh, <laughs> because it seemed appropriate that we do that because of the eagle experience. And then our friend had to leave um, for the day. So uh, Michael and I uh, left and went to Tim Hortons and had some good conversation about our own personal experiences from the past uh, that we've um, had. And uh, just the benefit of being able to share these experiences and how good that feels because a lot of this information we tend to keep to ourselves and can't share because not a lot of people understand um, these situations. So it's been wonderful to do that. Um, so then after that, we went to another park in London and uh, we had um, another set of cool experiences that were very unique, uh, especially for me. And uh, I think the first thing uh, Michael noticed was a craft up in the sky, really high up, and he was able to get uh, video footage of it. I could barely see it. It was a tiny speck, but it was moving in different directions. Um, there was a man in the park, he had a camera, and at a distance he was taking a picture of us, which was really unusual, why would anyone do that? He walked by us and stared in, in an uncomfortable manner, and then as he left the park he seemed to be taking more pictures of us and stared. And um, around that time period a black helicopter also flew over that was unmarked that was a new experience for me i really wasn't scared i didn't feel nervous i yep. felt He's very strong no, so that's that's good no anything on him wow that's get the f out of here and then on the way out um this was like the second time in my life we i saw uh we saw a big white orb above us um, as we were leaving the park and it was motoring along <laughs> it had a cute kind of feeling to it energy to it um, and it was a big orb i saw it with my own eyes not just a camera through a camera lens so that was a new experience for me so overall i've had some grand experiences the last month or so and i look forward to many more Hey, so that's the video. I want to thank Jen for being on camera and walking us through what happened last Sunday. And I want to thank Martin for, you know, editing and helping out with everything today. It's been really great. Um, yeah, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell. And also don't forget to have a vast experience.